Uh, some of the things that are really important to us is, is keeping up to date, being knowledgeable, sharing about our programs, learning about what's happening in watersheds next to ours or one from the uh, part of the state. One of the ways to tackle all of this, trying to get that information shared, is through our webinars and also through having a curated uh, playlist of recorded webinars. So, through the California Water Quality Monitoring Collaboration Network, another, another working group with the council, uh, I hosted the Swimmable California webinar series. It ran from September to uh, April. We have had previous webinars on safe to swim topics. Uh, e has been a presenter, Alicia's been a presenter. All of those are online. It's all been archived and they're in different playlists. Um, we had such great success with this. The feedback was fantastic. That it, what are we missing? What would be the next set of topics? So we'd like to continue hosting these, these webinars, but uh, He's sitting in LA. I just want to know what guy's perspective. I need help from you guys to understand what topics are important, what type of technology you like to hear about, programs you like to talk about. Jeremy had brief presentations he could give us, right? He's going to be about ready to get them to us. Yeah. He took off for he didn't want to hear me volunteer. Uh -huh. Don't worry, we will get him. Uh, but anyhow. So, why am I up here? So, what, what are your, what are you interested in? Technology, methods, projects, special studies. Um, would you like to speak and present about a project, or do you know somebody, wow, I'd really like to hear what they did. What are they working on? Um, like with Megan's presentation, or you know, any of the other presentations we had earlier with uh, data visualization. Um, we could even put together an enrichment you know, committee. Somebody that really likes to tackle education, hey, let me know. Let Karen know, let Alicia know. We're here to help everybody in the state achieve its role in California. And we've been using the word swimmable a lot, but it's about water contact. It's not just about recreation. There's more to it than that. Those are elements that need to go into the charter as well. So we're trying to expand things. Um, next, this is what uh, Karen was talking about. The National Water Quality Monitoring Council. They're off schedule. Usually we've had their conference this year. It's happening next year, uh, March 25th to 29th in Denver. Uh, they have had a conference in Denver previously. It's a great place to have a conference. Uh, the last one was fantastic. Um, right now, they are welcoming proposals for 15-minute oral presentations, posters, and then 90-minute extended sessions. Um, those would also include workshops, panel discussions, and facilitated roundtables. Um, due date for proposals is fast approaching. It's August 15th. Uh, in the past, I have given 15-minute uh, oral presentations, posters, and I ran a series of uh, workshops, uh, maybe three, maybe four years worth of workshops. Um, if you would like to put together a uh, 90 minute extended session about your Safe to Swim, California Safe to Swim programs, be glad to help facilitate that. Um, if you'd like to put together posters, or even a session of posters that are just theme based. Um, bringing in your posters, soliciting those from outside. Um, 15 minute oral presentations, uh, these are the topics. So we have a lot of speakers here that have spoken about these, these issues. Um, water quality prediction. You're done that? Yeah, just sit right there. Uh, Virgin risk of water quality. Monitoring water across changing hydrologic cycles. Uh, tools to mine, share, and visualize water quality data. Yeah. Um, innovative designs and technology for water quality monitoring assessment. 
taking things back there. So many of these topics are relevant to the work that we do. So I encourage you to not just go to the conference to be a part of it, to present, um, have a poster, or consider putting together a, a 90 minute special session. I can't. What, what's your take on these conferences? I love going to them. I've been to the last four. Um, I'm on the planning committee for this one. So, I mean, that's how much I value them. I'm part of the. It's true, because I've seen them at the last four. <laughs> so, it's, a, it's a great one. You, I always walk away from these with uh, a good sense of what other people are doing around the country. It makes me feel better about what we do here in California. Okay. And, and how frequently do they come out west? Did we they were in Portland eight years ago? Yeah, not too frequently. Yeah. So this is a good one to go to. It's, it's close by. You'll learn a lot. But I do encourage you to present, share the work that you're doing. 